Hi everyone, this is meteorologist Terry Swales. A little clipper moving across the Midwest this evening is bringing some snow to the area and our future track here depicts the heaviest accumulations generally between six and midnight tonight when one to two inches of snow will be a possibility, especially across the central and northern portions of the viewing area. And there's the blue as you see the snow depicted there moving off to the southeast and between six and midnight you can see how it's crossing out of Iowa and then eventually getting into eastern Illinois and moving on out of the area. And then we think our skies may actually clear a little bit here as we get towards the late night hours. And if that happens, low temperatures should easily get down to a around zero. Then we'll follow that up with some more cl clouds as we go through the morning hours on Tuesday as another disturbance approaches from the northwest. And you can see by late in the afternoon, more snow develops, but most of this is expected to remain north of Interstate 80 during the day on Tuesday. But Tuesday night and Wednesday, it starts to move southeast and will cover up the entire area. And it does look like most locations will see accumulating snows on the order of two to as much as six inches with the larger accumulations off to the north of the Quad Cities. And there are winter weather advisories in effect along and north of Highway 30, which again runs from Cedar Rapids to Sterling Rock Falls and right on over to Chicago. So the further north you go, the heavier the snows are expected to be. Looks like that all moves out of the area then on New Year's Day. And then behind that, colder air once again surges back into the upper Midwest. And our forecast here is looking this way as we go through the rest of the nighttime hours. Light snow, flurries, one to two inches of accumulation generally before midnight tonight. The low temperature eventually down to around two as winds switch to the northwest. And tomorrow then we may start with some sun, but more clouds come in during the afternoon. Snow should develop later in the afternoon across the north. And the high temperature expected to peak at about 13 degrees.